Now that we've defined our composition format, we can start combining the elements from the project panel in the layer stack on the left. To recap, the layer stack represents a side view of the layers stacked on top of each other, much like how you might take a side view of a hamburger with its ingredients stacked. The camera takes an image of this stack from above and displays the result in the viewer. Let's begin by stacking the elements, starting with the image of the basketball court with the name Playground. Drag this image from the project panel into the layer stack to create the first layer. In the lower left corner of the viewer, you can see that the format of this composition is full HD 1920 by 1080. The source label confirms that this is the format embedded in the composition. Now, double click on the basketball court PNG image. In the viewer, nothing seems to have changed visually but the orange frame at the top of the viewer indicates that we're now looking at the PNG image and not the composition that's using it. This visual warning is there to prevent you from making changes to elements within the composition and wondering why no changes are reflected in the viewer. The viewer shows that this PNG image has the exact same format as the composition. All composition pixels are completely covered by the image. In this case, we could have created a composition based on the format of this image. To do this, right-click on the basketball court PNG image and select Create Composition from Footage. The composition created from this image would use the exact same format as the image. As for the frame rate and duration, they would be defined by the default values in the Preferences window. Let's continue setting up our layer stack by selecting the basketball in the project panel and dragging it above the first basketball court layer. The viewer now displays the composite image, merging the basketball court and the basketball. Selecting the background adds a yellow outline around this rectangular image, and selecting the basketball adds this yellow outline around its silhouette, based on the transparent pixels. In this video, we went over how to add graphic elements to a composition, create a composition from one of these elements, and inspect the composition in the viewer.